Take a look at these three products from successful creators and see if you notice any similarities. Jevin Dovey's LUT Pack can grade your drone footage in a matter of minutes. Fitness Marshall's channel membership will help you sweat yourself sexy. And Justin Rhodes' membership site promises that you can homestead. So what did you see? There are a number of things that you might notice, but what I see is that these creators aren't selling you a product. They're selling you the promise of what you can become with their product. Crafting a value proposition like this is a key step in turning your audience into customers or subscribers. And to make one of your own, we need to go back in time. This telephone ad was printed in 1936 when less than 40% of American households had telephones. At the time, people needed to be convinced that owning a phone was worth the money. What AT&T didn't do in this ad is talk about the features of the phone, like how you could now call someone without the help of an operator. Wow. In fact, if you notice, the phone is barely in the picture at all. Instead, they make a promise to us, the readers, always be there by telephone. You can always be there by telephone. Now, let's go back to the future and apply this to your content. Great Scott! As a creator, we all get too close to our content. It happens to me all the time. It gets really hard to find enough separation to actually be objective about your own stuff. But it's an essential part of this process for us to step out of our creator shoes and into our audience shoes so we can best learn what it is that the viewer gets isn't getting or needs to get from their experience with you. So it's time to get into audience mode and dial in on what the viewer gets from this experience. The best place to start is by asking yourself, what problems can my content solve? How does my content help create change from before purchase to after? This change could be helping people get stronger, teaching a new skill, or making people laugh. Even entertainment content has a unique value proposition. An action comedy is going to provide a very different experience than, let's say, a period romance. To quickly summarize a value proposition, you can use this formula. We help X do Y by doing Z. Take some time and build out yours now. You can even pause this video, take some time to workshop yours, and then come back. I'll still be here for you. Once you've got your value proposition, you need a way for your audience to see that value before they subscribe or click add to cart. A landing page is a great way to do that. And by the way, you can make a landing page with Uscreen with no code required. Coach's Voice Academy has an awesome landing page. And right at the top, we see the promised outcome of signing up for their membership is quote, becoming a better football coach. With their promise made, they can expand on it to make the case for their program, including details about the coaches, what kind of lessons to expect, and even a free class to really back up their claims. This brings us to maybe the most important part of the process. You've got to prove that you're able to deliver on your promise. YouTube is a great place to show that proof and then funnel people to your own site when they want more. To bring this full circle, let's go back to those examples from the top of the video. Jevin Dovey shows off his drone footage, so if you like how his videos look, you might want his LUT pack. Fitness Marshall posts free three minute song workouts as a preview of what you'll get from a membership. Justin Rhodes has daily vlogs that prove he knows his stuff about homesteading while letting you feel like you're hanging out with a friend. And I'm telling you that you'll get more free tips for monetizing your content by subscribing to our channel here on YouTube when you click the red button below. And we'll prove it with the video on screen right now. Thanks so much for watching. I'll see you next time.